Hey, Warrior fans, we are back for the second half. Lady, Lady Warriors versus the Rabbit Lions. And the uh, score going into the second half is 14 to 5. Trying to get the YouTube link posted on our Facebook page for those who find it that way. Lady Lions get the first. Uh, First possession, shot up, no good. Lady Warriors attacking on offense. Evelyn Albright there at the top of the key. Pass over to Elena OMB. Rattles around and almost is taken away. Not sure who that pass was to. back on defense again. Uh, I think they're calling that at a walk. I'm not really sure what the call was there. You guys probably know better than I do. The Lady Warriors. They had another chance to run their offense. And Owen B inside the Kara's Inc. She's going to get fouled by Kinley. Lady Lion, Lady Warrior is going to throw it in around their own basket. Evan Albright falling the ball, throwing the ball in. She gets it into Kara Zank. Top of the key to Grayson Moore. Inside of Kara Zank, she comes away with it and they're gonna call a foul. So I think she's gonna get a chance. No, no, no chance to shoot free throws. But we are gonna get a chance to throw it under throw it in under our own basket again. Maybe Warriors into Kara Zank and she throws up one off the glass. Awesome job, Kara. So, cuts into that lead a little bit. 14 to seven is our score. And then Lady Warriors get a steal. So a score and a steal. And uh, we're happy to see it. Stolen away there by the Lions. Shot up, no good, no rebound. Number 21, not able to hit there. Grayson Morris, got a ball stolen from her. Layup for the Lady Lions, no good. And they get the rebound. Somehow I knew that was going to be called. There's three fouls there on Kara Zink. And there's a couple of free throws for the Lady Lions. 16 to 7 is our score. And uh, first one rattles around. No good. Second one didn't hitch anything but air, so the Lady Warriors are going to get a chance to run some offense again. Kara Zank, oh, thought she was going to get a layup, but unfortunately she has the ball stripped. It's a jump ball, but... Lady Lions are going to retain possession on the all-stain possession. So Grayson Moore is going to throw the ball in under our own basket here. Oh, you missed her. Oh, you missed her. 
Inbound pass is stolen away by number 21 from Gravit. She's been their MVP for sure. Bailey Bishman, sorry, not Bailey Bishman. Elena Ownby gets a block, no foul called, but then there's a foul called on the second shot put up there by number 13. That's the first foul on number 20, Bailey Bookman. First shot up, no good. 16 to seven, about three minutes and 20 seconds left in the third quarter here. Second shot up, no good. Bailey Bookman runs down the rebound. Oh, ball taken away from her. from Gravit just drives past our ladies and puts one in, a little right-handed layup. Grayson Moore tries a similar thing, drive through, and um, this the ball strip. Elena Lemme gets it back, and she, Elena, is fouled, so she's going to draw a foul there. Gravit has a whole bunch of subs, though, so I don't think they're worried necessarily about being uh, in foul trouble for any of their ladies. Ball thrown up, pass stolen away. Lane Allenby rebounds and the ball is stripped away from her. Lady Lions get it back. Number 21 does up another shot, no good. Grayson Moore gets the ball and try to drive in. Let's see. She gets fouled on the drive. I think we'd rather have to pass to Kara Zankin to score, but I guess we'll take the foul because that's what they call. That's only the fourth foul against the Lions in this quarter, so no shots yet. A Lions got to throw it in under their own basket here. Probably not Lady Lions. Lady Warriors, I should say, not Lady Lions. Oh, you better get it in, better get it in. Grayson can't get it in, so she throws it off of the Lady Lion's foot, and out of bounds it goes. So another fresh five to try to get it in this time. Oh, that's got to be a walk, but they didn't call it. Goodness gracious. Lady Lion's got a chance at a layup. No good. They get the rebound, and they send it up the top of the key. And that means five takes a shot, no good. Gets her own rebound. Another shot thrown up there by the Lady Lions, and that one's nothing but air, so out of bounds it goes. And the Lady Warriors gonna get the ball back. Two minutes left to play in this third quarter. 18 to seven is our score, and Grayson Moore Drive the left hand, hits a Ellen Albright. Top of the key, Evelyn looking for and finding Elena Owenby. Elena gets fouled by number 24. She's only got one, I think she's got two now. So, yeah, two, two to five is the foul count against uh, the Lady Lions and Lady Warriors. Grayson throws the ball up, Elena Owenby goes to get it. There's a tie ball. That time it's going to go to the Lady Lions on the alternating possession. So turnover there on that pass. And Lady Lions going to get a chance to add to their lead here if we can't get a defensive stop. Top of the keeper, grab it. Top rolls around and in. Top of the key three there. And timeout there, grab it. It's a 30 second timeout. And 21 to 7 is our score here in the third quarter. A little over a minute to play, a minute 14 to play in this third quarter. We'll zoom in and let you guys see our lady warriors here for the next 30 seconds. Who 
look tired, and I would be too if I had no chance at getting a sub, playing the whole game. back on the floor. There you go. Play this last minute 14. Oh, Grayson Morse dribble taken away from her. Outside it goes to number 44, thinks about a shot, instead she drives, and around the key it goes, this time 44 does take a shot, and it's good. 24 to 7 is our score. Grayson Moore, gotta get the ball down, gotta get a drive down. Number 24 called for another foul, that's three on her. Call for the reach, and uh, is that six fouls or seven? I guess that's six in this half for the Lady Lions, so no shots yet, but any other fouls will get a shot. Oh, goodness, you gotta call that foul. Oh, Paris Ain't gets the ball taken away from her. Um, Kara affects the shot. She doesn't make it, but we can't get the rebound either. Out of bounds it goes, it's gonna belong to the Lady Lions. My thought is that uh, number zero just pushed Kara Zank all over the place, but that's not what the call was. Lena Owen B gets the rebound. She gets to Grayson Moore, and Grayson's going to dribble up for us. She finds Kara Zank. Kara over to Lena Owen B. Lena Owen B going to get a shot off. No good. Karazank rebounds and tries to put back. No good. Lena Owenby gets that rebound and puts back and scores for the Lady Warriors. So 20, 24 to 9 is our score. Minute, sorry, second left. Gravit throws a shot from midcourt. No good. And so going into our fourth quarter, it is 24 to 9 in favor of the Lady Lions. Let you guys zoom in and see our ladies taking a quick break. of the horn for the quarter to start again. So it'll be 24 to nine in our, start our fourth quarter. Ball is gonna start with Lady Warriors in possession. And Evelyn Albright's gonna throw it in for the Warriors. She gets it into Grayson Moore. He throws a pass to Elena Owen B. That pass knocked away and out of bounds, but it's going to stay with the Lady Warriors. And be careful about this five count. Sometimes they have a quick trigger. Over the top it goes to Kara Zane. Kara Zane's going to draw a foul. That's seven. She's going to get a shoot either way. She wasn't shooting whenever she foul happened, but she's going to get a shoot of one and one here. That's three fouls on number 44 for Grab It. First one rattles around out. And no opportunity to shoot a second because we're still on the one and one here. Lady Lions push the ball up. And their pass gets stolen away by Elena Owenby. Elena Owenby is going to drive down. And, oh, missed the layup. Grayson Moore there to finish and get a stick back. Well done, Grayson. Great steal there, Elena. 24 to 11 is our score. 
pass down to number 35. Inside it goes. Knocked away there by Elena Owenby. She's going to get a chance to get another layup. Nope, just kidding. Back to Kara Zank it goes. Kara's going to bring it across the timeline and hit. Oh, try to hit Bailey Boothman, but that pass intercepted. So Lady Lions get it back. Lions looking around the key. 10, 21 in the corner. 21 has hit. She's hit several for them today. She's been their best shooter for sure. And I don't know why we're not out there on her, but. Oh, goodness. Now she gets another steal for them. She's probably going to get another layup out of this. She does. Grayson Moore not able to handle the pressure for number 21. 29 to 11 is our score. She. Oh. Let's see. 21's going to get another foul yeah. called on her. Nope. 14's going to get a foul called on her. So Karazin's going to get a chance to shoot again. 29 to 11, four minutes and 16 seconds left to play in our contest. And Kara Zank's gonna get a chance to shoot in a one and one. Shot up, no good. Rebound Bailey Boothman. But she throws it right to the grab it. Lady Lion. Layup attempt, Lady Lions, no good. Rebound Lady Lions. Swarm of Lady Warriors all over them. Grab it once a timeout since they were afraid of a turnover, it looks like. So, with exactly four minutes left to play, the Lady, Lady Warriors are down 29 to 11. And um, hoping that they can get the defensive stop and go down there and score a little bit more. Lady Lions have hit some good looking threes from outside whenever we weren't able to get a hand in their face. Not super consistently, but enough to where I bet number 21 has 12 or 15 points. If I were guessing, I think she's got at least three threes, maybe four, and um, some layups on it. So she's probably their, their number one scorer. No way I can tell you. <laughs> it has it on the board. I don't even have to guess. She has 10 points for them. Yeah, so she's the only one on the board who has any points for them right now is uh, number 21. Yeah. So. She's playing well for sure. So, Lady Warriors, beefing in the inbound pace. Shot up, no good. Bailey Boothman rebounds, but immediately they tie it up. And uh, it's gonna stay with the Lady Lions on the alternating possession. No good for the Lions. Rebound to Valen Boothman. This time she gets it to a ball handler. And, oh. Grayson gets it to Elena Owenby. Two quick dribbles and picks up the ball. Out it goes to Evelyn Albright. She gets it to Grayson Moore. Grayson struggles and fights for it. Another jump ball called. All game possession is going to stay with Lifeway. So Lady Lions gonna throw it in on the sideline over there in front of their own bench. Gotta watch that five second call. Two, three. Oh, Lady Lions take away, but they're gonna call a walk travel on them. So Lady Warriors gonna get it back. Grayson Moore throwing it in again from the sideline. Timeout called. Uh oh. I think 
a holding call is going to be called on. Yep, number zero gets a holding call. That's her third foul. And uh, Kara Zank is going to get a chance to shoot some free throws again. Another one and one. No good. Out of bounds it goes. Going to stay with the Warriors. Knocked out of bounds by the Lions. So, Grayson Moore. Throwing it in for the Lady Warriors. And it goes to Elena Omi. Elena Omi is going to get a drive. There's another reach. Shut up. No good. Last touch by the Lions. Going to stay with the Warriors again. And it goes to Kara Zank. Kara kind of try to drive and shoot from the baseline. Shot way off, but fight for the rebound. Oh, goodness. Layup there by the Lady Warriors, rebounded by Elena Owenby, and uh, she's fouled, so she's going to get a chance to shoot. That's 10 fouls on the Lions, and. Uh, It's like that's a foul on them. It's got to be. So, oops, sorry, I got that right in your face. First one up and in, 12, 29 to 12. Lane LME getting a second one up. That one didn't hit anything. So, I'm gonna go back to the Lady Lions. Two minutes, 41 seconds left to play. In the uh, fourth quarter, there's a, that should have been a travel, but not called. Out of bounds it goes. We're going to say last touch by the Lady Lions. So life is going to get it back. 29 to 12 is our score. Two minutes, 30 seconds left to play in the fourth quarter. Grayson Moore dribbles it up. She's going to find Kara Zank. Kara, turn around. Got a shot up. No good. Elena Owenby fights for the rebound. Knocks it out of bounds. So, Lady Lions are going to have the ball back. They're making quite a few subs in, getting some of their players that don't usually get a chance to play from PT. Out of bounds, that ball goes. And Lady Warriors are going to get another chance to score here. There's a timeout on the floor. So, Lady Warriors getting one more chance to take a rest and think about their last two minutes on the floor and what they're going to do and how they're going to play it. We got a special treat for you, live stream fans. Kat Britton just walked by. She said that she would love to talk to you guys and tell you all of her basketball knowledge and skills. Kat Britton, what do you think we need to do in the last two minutes of this game? In case you, in case you missed that, she said she hadn't seen enough to give you any insight, which means she wasn't here for the games, friends. You heard it first. Tidwell, a much bigger fan of the Warriors than Kat Britton. <laughs> just kidding. Love to give Kat a hard time. She's joined over there by uh, Lifeway alumni, Madison Spencer, who also could give us some, she could drop some basketball knowledge on us if she wanted to. All right, so Lady, Lady Warrior's gonna get it back. Two minutes left to play, down 29 to 12. Grayson Moore, oh. Ball stolen away from her. And 
Lady Lions. Lady Lions get stolen back away from them. So just balls flying everywhere. Bailey Booth finally comes up with it, gets it across. Her pass is stolen away by Grayson Moore, who we thought was going to be in super foul trouble the rest of the way, but she's had not got any fouls this second half. So that's super important. Stayed in. Got to have her on the floor. Got to have all these girls on the floor. There's only five, right? But especially, uh, especially Grayson. And let's see. Passing all about around. Lady Lions looking for a shot. No good. Grayson Moore's going to get a chance. Thought she was going to get a chance at a layup. But instead, she leaves it for Elena Owenby. Elena Owenby might have a chance for a layup. No good. Rebounded by Kara Zank. Kara Zank puts it up. No good. Touched last by the Lady Lions. So it's going to be a uh, lifeway ball thrown under their own basket. Sorry about that interruption. TJ likes to be on camera. <laughs> Inside it goes to Kara Zank. Kara Zank. Oh, shot no good. Fight for the rebound. Oh. Almost got the ball back. Did Grayson Moore, but just just not able to hang on to it. 44 seconds left. Lady Warriors putting on a little bit of pressure trying to get the ball back. Down 29 to 12. And uh, let's see. They do get the ball back. Oh, no. Lady, Ly Lady Lions scrapping on the floor. Jump ball is called. It's going to remain with the Lady Lions. Good, good pressure, good hustle there, Lady Warriors. Fighting all the way to the end. We like that. In the ball goes. That's got to be a travel. It was. So, 24 seconds left. Grace is going to bring it down and look for one more score to make the scoreboard a little more palpable, I think. Inside it goes to Elena Ombi. Elena's going to get a shot off. Just missed. Lady Lions, Lady Lions get the rebound. Down to four they go. Five seconds left. Might have a chance at the rebound. Oh, but gets fouled. Ooh. Gets fouled hard and into the goal she goes. Hope she's okay. So two seconds left and... Uh, there's a foul there on Grayson Moore. First shot rolls around in. 30 to 13 is our score. Second one rolls around in. 31 to 13. Two seconds left. Evelyn Albright gets it in to Kara Zank. She's going to get a chance to throw one up, but not able to get the air close enough to do it. So that's the end of our game. 30 to 13 is our final score, and we will be right back with you in just a few minutes for the Junior High Boys. <laughs> 